Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I feel like I have not filmed in forever, but this is my May favorites. It's a few days late, but I really didn't have that many favorites to share with you since I just did like a little haul review. Um, I already told you the things that I liked and didn't like, and I didn't haul a lot this month, which is probably a good thing. It's a good thing on my credit card. Um, one thing that I do love and that is a favorite is my new Jeep. I went out and bought a brand new Jeep this month um, and I love it. It was not what I was in the market for, but I absolutely love my Jeep. So then for makeup, um, I just have a couple things this month. Like I said, I didn't really haul a lot. Um, one thing that I bought was um, from Makeup Revolution. It's the Ultra Eyeshadows in the Matte. And I'll show you that. I just, I love this palette. It's all mattes and um, yeah, I, it was um, short money. I want to say, oh, I want to say it was 16 or $12, something like that. It was short money and I love the colors. I'm really into like the pinky browns that are in here. I probably use the most. Of, um, then I, ha I used this one to do my crease this morning. Um, so that's definitely one of my favorites this month. Also, I finally found, not finally found, I mean, I can buy it online, but where I live, we don't have a wide selection of drugstore makeup, and they finally added the L'Oreal Infallible line at my drugstore. So I finally got, I finally purchased the Infallible Matte Foundation, and I got this one in Natural Buff. It's perfect on me, I love it. Um, this is definitely a favorite, but I kind of have two favorites this month for foundations. The other one was sent to me in a sample size, and it is the Kat Von D Locket Tattoo Foundation. This is in the Light 48. This was also the perfect shade for me. It was sent to me, I think, in my Sephora samples. I have a little tiny bit left. I just ordered the full size from Sephora. I've been using this the past um, three or four days. I absolutely love it. I love the coverage. I love the way it feels. I love the way it lasts. And I love that it's like $35 as opposed to my Dior, which is like 65. So yeah, really, really liked that. I've also been using ColourPop Lippy Stick in a Monkey. I've been using that a lot this month. It's what I have on right now. I've promised a few other YouTubers that I would give more of a nude lip a try. And I'm struggling because you know I love my red lipstick life. Um, but this is Monkey and it's a little too pink for me so I put a little bit of a gloss over it. And this is a hyper gloss um, lippy stick. I do like their hyper gloss colors. Um, yeah, so this is something new and different for me and I'm really liking it. Then, as you know, in one of my, I think it was my Birch Box, I got this uh, model company bronzer and I wasn't too sure about it. I said that I would work with it and play around with it a little bit because it has a shimmer to it. And usually I like my bronzers to be more matte because I usually contour with them. And this one I actually, I've been liking, so I wasn't, like I said, I wasn't sure about it when it came, it came in my BoxyCharm, and I actually am really liking it. It was a little tough to blend out the first couple of times I used it, so I've really had to realize that um, less is more, and to go really light-handed with it when I do use it, but I think it'll be nice this summer. Um, I wouldn't actually say it's a favorite, but it definitely um, performed a lot better and I liked it a lot better than I ever imagined. So yeah, and that is it for my May favorites. Short and sweet. 
So there you have it. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, put some comments down below. If you've used any of these products, please let me know how you've liked them or, or if you haven't liked them, what's worked or not for you. And I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye. Send me free, why don't you, babe? Get out my life, why don't you, babe? You don't really love me. You just keep me hanging on.